Hello, I'm Rich Bonaducci. And I'm Holly Love. And this is Talk 365. Hello and welcome to Talk 365. We have a great show for you today and it's only our second show. But we're having so much fun. We're, we're there. We're already on a roll. Already. I have news you can use today, which is coming up next, which means I'm bringing you the latest and greatest in everything self-improvement, fashion, fitness, hair, makeup. You're going to love it. Am I? You really are. I actually did this one with you in mind and you'll oh. see why. Oh, okay. Well, you're going to like what I'm doing, too. Mm -hmm. Loot Crate, monthly gift subscription box. We're going to open it right here on the show, and I'm going to show you all the cool geek stuff that's in there. I've been waiting for this. Yeah. Literally. Okay. I'm, I really am actually super excited wait, for that. Wait a month. And we are talking small business loans with University Credit Union, and we have a surprise new segment to announce and unveil. Dun, da, da, dun. So do. basically, this is going to be a really fun show. Don't go anywhere. Told you. We're on a roll. Two is a roll. Talk 365 studio space provided by Media Riff. You're right. I'm not going to get promoted without that degree. It's time to do it, Diana. Yeah, but an online university feels so impersonal. What if I need help? Take a look at WGU. A faculty mentor works with you from day one to graduation. A mentor, huh? I mean, that sounds great. Would you like to try some mouse? Uh. Are they gluten-free? Innovative, online, and surprisingly affordable. WGU, it's a new kind of you. Lashes for the Talk 365 team. Yes, that's you, Rich. Just kidding, it's Holly. Provided by Sweet Lash. Welcome back to Talk 365. Now, I hear this is a news that even I can use. Well, it will be a news <laughs> that even you can use, but I think it's a news you can use you're gonna like. Surprise me. Okay, as I said earlier, but just in case you missed it, when I do news you can use, it is always bringing you the latest and greatest in everything self-improvement, fashion, hair, makeup, and today... And when I do it, it's everything else. <laughs> Which is probably pretty true. Today we are talking eyebrows. W wow. No, how are you not... Okay, just standing by. No, I'm a fan of my I'm eyebrows. going to say, arguably, the best feature on the face. Rich, do you agree? The eyes? Yeah. Eyebrows. Them too. They're like the eyes hat. See, I'm curious because your girlfriend Val probably arguably is a Romulan. has the most beautiful eyebrows on the planet. She's a Romulan. Like they're amazing. They're like what everybody wants. They're thick, they're perfect. They are baby. Perfectly arched, dark all the way. They are welcome mats of hair. I, I immediately thought of you when we were talking about this. Arguably the best. You think of me? You thought of her. Well, yeah, same, you know. I was thinking your reaction would be you love eyebrows. Here's my reaction I love eyebrows. Okay, here's what I think about eyebrows. Basically, they frame the face, and I think for the most part, unless they're really freaky, your you hair don't really your face. notice them. Or they frame your eyes. They're like the, the framing for your eyes. I'm eyeballs just gonna, I'm or gonna let you do like this because I don't know for my eyebrows. 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 But I think if they're good, you I notice broke. them as being a good thing, like Val's. Like, wow, they're beautiful, and then the whole face is beautiful and everything works. Or if they're bad, remember the interview you had a couple weeks ago where you said you couldn't focus on the interview because there were like rogue brows going everywhere? Oh, yeah. Yeah, the dude was like, yeah, he, <laughs> had, he had like cat eyebrows. They were just a bunch of stuff sticking out of his head. Yeah. yeah. See, so when he they're had bad, old man eyebrows. It's really bad, right? Yeah. So obviously, whether or not you're happy with your eyebrows or not, or if you are unhappy with your eyebrows, I've got a really cool new solution for you. Now, there are temporary fixes out, right? All kinds of temporary fixes out right now. There okay. is gels and there is, you know, eyebrow pencils to fill it in if you don't have very thick eyebrows. Okay. Or unruly, like, you know, the... That, and you can like put those or down a little always, bit you, or trim. You can always trim them. 
that too. If you think this is natural, you're nuts. I trim like weekly. Manscaping is happening all over yeah, the place. It has to. It does. My head would look like my armpit. You don't like the Wolverine for no reason is what you're saying. I do like Wolverine. <laughs> I have my reasons, but his eyebrows aren't two of them. Okay, so then there are permanent solutions that have been around a long time, like uh, tattooed makeup. Permanent makeup. Permanent makeup. But if you can imagine, and if you can't, just Google permanent makeup eyebrows, and you'll see that the odds are pretty high that that's going to turn out looking like you had a Sharpie line drawn on your face. It, it doesn't work so good sometimes. Like that? Pretty much. There you, you go. Don't, you don't want that. So, the okay. new semi -per nope. semi-permanent solution is called, are you ready for it? Yes. Microblading. Microblading, what is Microblading. that? Microblading, it's a semi-permanent tattooing procedure that they use a special microblading pen okay. to do teeny tiny like single lines, like hairs. Okay, just kind of draw them in a little bit and there, uh -huh. fill so it in. It's more natural looking. It's a very tedious, you know, very precise mm -hmm. new procedure. You obviously want somebody who is very experienced in doing this because it could go wrong, even though it's semi-permanent. It's going to last for a while. It's still a tattoo. So, so how long does it last? About a year, and then you have to have oh, it touched up. That's pretty permanent. Yeah, I mean, it's not I like, mean you oh, don't it want it to like months. go here and here. Right. You want to make sure, which leads me to my next point. It takes about two hours for the whole thing to um, take place, and okay. the majority of the time is planning the eyebrow shape that works best for your face shape. Do you change your eyebrows based on like where you're going on a date or something? Mm -mm. I so, just so have what I think shape, looks good on me. That's pretty much going to be your shape. Yeah, forevermore. Okay, okay. But maybe some people do, and there's always like eyebrow. T In fact, I was reading about this on InStyle.com. And it was like, have the latest in feathery brows. And I was like, feathery brows? Feathery brows. <laughs> Farrah Fawcett brows. <laughs> Maybe that's making a comeback. 70s. Sort I of, doubt it. Yeah. I don't know. But anyway, so maybe maybe there's fashion tr trends with brows. But you want to avoid, experts say, I'm going back to shape. If they say they can do it in less than an hour, run. Because the majority of the time is spent drawing on and making sure that is the perfect shape for your face pre, before they start putting it on. So if they're only doing an hour, they're not doing that stuff. Pre-micro blade planning. Yes, you need to do some pre-planning. The whole thing costs around seven or eight hundred dollars. And An again, eye or total? No, just total. Mm -hmm. And again, you're gonna go back about once a year because they fade and, and you need to have them touched up. So if you are on the quest for the perfect eyebrows or you want to just wake up and have them perfect and you don't want to mess with anything, then maybe microblading is for you. If not, at least for heaven's sakes, trim. They shouldn't come out farther than your nose, ever, ever, ever. Okay, well, while Rich is doing some math and figuring out how much it will cost him to have eyebrows even close to equally as awesome as his girlfriend Val's, because, you know, do you ever do you ever feel bad about your eyebrows? Do they feel bad in comparison? No, I feel bad that my eyebrows, that I couldn't, like, mine my eyebrows and stick it in the top of my head. <laughs> can they, ooh, can they do that? Can they just freaking microderm whatever blade. my head, microblade my head? I, I would they try could. that. I would try that if you're willing to give it a shot. Wow, please, It would last a year. Please email Someone us. Someone just take Facebook a little set. Sharpie and just... Please send me something if you're willing to try that on, on Rich's head because that would be so much I fun. I would so do it. And then we will call Bosley and get it fixed for real because, wow, that's scary. Wish you would, huh? I would. I know. See, you know what I would you do? You like my everything. I would, I would draw... Latest and greatest. I would draw a widow's peak right on my head please and then just do a fill it in. No. No, I want a widow's peak. Are you serious? I want, oh, that would look cool, I think. No. Yeah, it would. Like Dracula? Yeah. Okay, absolutely no. Okay, no more of that. No, 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 no. I'm getting a widow's peak. Don't go anywhere. We will be right back right after this. Lash artists for the Talk 365 team provided by Sweet Lash. I'm Holly Love and I am here at the Certified Hypnotherapy Training School with my good friend Dennis Parker. Dennis, I have three questions for you. Are you ready? I'm ready. Number one, when do classes start? 
A person can uh, start with the online portion of the training anytime and then uh, come into the live classroom trainings as we have them scheduled. Who's signing up and why? We have uh, people who sign up to be certified clinical hypnotherapists who want to have those clinical skills to be able to affect behavioral modification, who want to help people uh, make major changes in their lives like uh, overcome fears and phobias, all kinds of different uh, behavioral issues. Uh, we have uh, people who are executives or managers or who want to have other career enhancements uh, and have these same behavioral modification skills. And we also have grandparents and parents who want to know how to work with their own children and family. Uh, those folks who come in, uh, we give them a much reduced rate uh, because they're not going to start a business and, and they just want to be able to help their family and loved ones. Fantastic. Number three, beyond that discount, um, what happens if people mention that they saw us on Talk 365 or in Davis County? We're offering a $200 textbook and CD package as part of their full registration. Nice. All of this information and more is available on the website. Log on and change your life today. Set design for Talk 365 is provided in part by Consign and Design. Welcome back, everybody. We have finally got to the Loot Crate box. I have been waiting for this for a month. If you were just barely tuning in, Mr. Rich Bonaducci has ordered this. What is it called again? Well, this is Loot Crate, but they actually have a bunch of different kinds of boxes. Uh -huh. This one happens to be a, a mix of like uh, gamer gear, anime, geek stuff. They're called subscription boxes. Yeah, monthly subscription boxes. You can get them from lots of different places. Anything to do with like hair and makeup or shaving goods or clothes, food. Basically you know. just go on Pinterest and put in subscription boxes. It, mind blown if you don't know about yeah. this because they are huge. Pretty and much, we've been waiting for this one for a month. I'm excited, go. Pretty much any oh, interest oh, oh, you oh, have is out there at any price level too. Now this one again has a lot of geek stuff in it so let's just go through it. This was February's box and because uh, The Walking Dead had come back on the air mm -hmm. after its you know hiatus and of course Deadpool is out. This is a dead themed box. This mm -hmm. is a little Daryl. It's a little Daryl from The Walking Dead. You can hold them. Okay. Most girls want to hold Daryl. By sure. The way. He has cute little wings. He has cute little wings on his jacket. See, the figures were in this envelope right here. And of course, uh, you also get this pin. Now, every one of the Loot Crate boxes has a pin like this, a little hashtag on it. This one is dead themed. But you can see the hashtag on the back. Well, you go online, you punch in the hashtag, and you can win mm. something else. And what you win is another Walking Dead figure, which this month <gasps> I believe is Coral. It's Coral. And he has a machete. Ooh, okay. <laughs> you also have a little booklet in this one. Lots of, of uh, cool stuff about The Walking Dead and whatnot. And little quizzes. Which character are you? Which uh, character are you? I'm Daryl. Okay. My motorcycle is the only home I need. No. I look pretty cool with a beard. No. I make a mean plate of cookies. Uh, sure. My son won't stay in the house. No. I'm handy with a crossbow. <laughs> no. I'm not a fan of barns. Sure. All right. I lived a tough life, but I survived. Absolutely. I'm a natural leader who makes really lousy plans that always backfire. Nope. I'm an awesome leader who makes awesome plans that always work awesomely. You, you like flowers. Yeah, I like the flowers. Change that a little bit. Friends, who needs friends? I like friends. Okay. I might have a death wish. I've been there. But not right now. I seem sweet, but I'm secretly dangerous. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, you're uh, you're you're Carol. <laughs> yep. Oh. There you go. Also from Walking Dead, soap on a rope. That's gross. That looked like <laughs> that's perfect response. It's so gross. These are little ears. Yeah. You don't have to drop the soap. You just wrap it around your neck and you use the ears to clean yourself off. You can hear yourself clean long before it happens. Mm -mm. 
I don't know what that means. But anyway, there that is. Now, again, Deadpool came out in theaters. Uh -huh. This is an exclusive Deadpool figurine Ooh, for, for Loot Crate. And I've really? already taken it out. This is a little Deadpool card that you can display it on. But basically, here's the figure. Look at that. Wow. Is he like, does he have like a pool of smoke? He is explosion? not a genie. I'm pretty sure this is an explosion and he's coming right out of it. It looks really cool. I like that. Here, let me see. I there love Deadpool, But by you're the not going to get that Ryan anywhere Reynolds. else. That is an exclusive for a loot crate. We'll just put that right here. That and by is the way, awesome. as I mentioned, they have different kinds of subscriptions. Uh -huh. uh, you can get one for one month, three months, six months, or if you go 12 months like I did, mm -hmm. you get t shirts with every oh. box. And again, this one is dead themed. This is a Deadpool t shirt. That is a really cool t-shirt. Now, were you able to say in advance what size you are? Absolutely. You okay. give them your size and so it fits. And by the way, if it turns out that it doesn't fit, you can send it back and they give you another one. But also, if you end up doing the 12-month subscription box, uh -huh. they give you an extra t-shirt on top of that just for thanks for doing it for 12 months kind of t-shirt thing. And again, this is this company called Loot Crate. Mm -hmm. You can find them online and they have multiple boxes, not right. just this one. And you were saying they have boxes for your pets. Yeah, they do. Yeah, yeah. Mainly dogs right now, by uh -huh. the way. But all the boxes come in black, but then you can turn them inside out and they'll be different theme. This is obviously a dead theme and you can fold it the other way and it's kind of a display box for all your stuff. Which but we could use right now to be able to... We like, could. We could do all this stuff. If we could do origami really fast and <laughs> yes, work yes, under we a could. time crunch. Got to have Daryl there and all that. Mm -hmm. Now let me okay, make sure really I get cool. this right. The, uh, you mentioned, yes, they have loot pets for dogs. They also have loot, uh, loot anime, loot gaming uh -huh. gear and stuff like that. Okay. They also have clothing. You can okay. get uh, like geek wear, wearables or accessories. They have stuff strictly for girls. Uh -huh. They have uh, this combination uh, t-shirt sock thing. Every month a different Did theme. Did you sign up for the sock stuff. thing because you're a sock person? I am a sock person. I'm thinking about it. But I got this one first because of all the geek you stuff know what, in just, here. This is a really good present for oh, somebody. Yeah. Because just like I wish I wouldn't have said it because obviously... I, you, I could give you that and you would get new something every month right. that would be a surprise to you and you would enjoy your birthday all year round all year or long. your Christmas present or whatever. Yeah. So like for your kids and for anyone really. Yeah. They, well, they, how much fun? It's better than like fruit of the month. Well, the, the great thing about it is that um, each box has about $45 worth of stuff mm -hmm. a month. But you're not spending $45 a month, only about between, well, I won't, I, won't, I won't say necessarily, depending on the box you get. And again, there's no commitment, by the way. If you end up going, oh, this isn't really for me, you can cancel at any time, even okay. if you got signed up for a 12-month thing. It doesn't hold you to it. No, not at all. And Very it's delivered cool. in the third week of every month. Something really cool comes, and like you mentioned, that would make a great, rather than get someone a gift once. Get them a gift and it comes every month with some cool stuff and they don't know what it is until they get it's, here. Because it's like their birthday every time. Right. And if they have special interests like Firefly, you can get a Firefly crate. In fact, I think they have, oh yeah, limited edition crates for like Star Wars and Call of Duty, stuff like that. Awesome. And again, lots of these boxes have exclusive items in it. So that if you're going to Comic-Con. Only to Loot Crate. Right. Members. Yeah, so if you're going to Comic Con or something like that and you want to wear something, guess what? You're wearing something that only your fellow Loot Crate guys have. And you'll see each other and you'll be like, we are awesome. You'll be like, oh, loot pound crate. it. Uh, loot Crate, yeah, pound mm -hmm. that. So get on their website, lootcrate.com, that each month has a different theme. I believe March's is Versus because of Batman versus Superman, but oh, they also have kind of Alien versus Predator stuff in there. We'll see. Cool. We'll see in about a month. Okay. But I will make sure to wear this shirt in the meantime, as well as the G thanks for joining shirt. I didn't even know was coming. Thank you, Loot Crate. So uh, check it out. Sign up. It is cool stuff. It's a lot of fun. Very cool. Can yeah. I wear Can I wear these? Yeah, I, I wish you would use that. It's soap. Okay. Well, I'm going to rip into this. Don't go anywhere. Coming up next, I get to talk to Steve from University Credit Union Small Business Loans. We'll be right back right after this. I'm ripping into it. Rip. If I had Carl's here, I, we could cut it with his machine. That'd be fun. Hey everybody, it's Holly Love and I am here with my old friend Todd Summers. Todd, you are now the marketing manager of University Credit Union and guess what? I just became a member today. Tell them why they should become members. You should become a member, especially if you love University of Utah. 
see our red color, Holly's red hair, the lips, it's, it's just, it works. Lots of benefits from a credit union. No fees, low interest rates on loans, car loans, friendly local service. Speaking of car loans, I've been needing a new car and you guys were fantastic. You recommended that I come here first before I go to the dealer, get pre-approved. I figured out what's going on with my credit, what I need to do to fix it, uh, how much my loan will be, how much I would pay per month in order to get the car I want to be in. You guys were so helpful. I am like prepared, armed, ready for battle to go find the perfect car. There is really just no excuse to not get in here to University Credit Union and join. Become a member today like me and Todd. University Credit Union, local to Utah, loyal to you. Welcome back to Talk 365, and I'm not going to mess with this anymore because I got it all over my hand. I got it everywhere but where I really wanted it. <laughs> Which we're really glad you didn't get it on your face, Mike Tyson. There should be, oh, oh. No. No. There should be a new small business that helps microblade my own head because I obviously can't. I actually know where they could go to get a loan to do that. Where? University Credit Union Small Business Loan. Wow. Mm-hmm. Yeah. They're that actually amazing in all seriousness. If you have an idea for a small business or a big business, it doesn't matter either one, and you think, I've got to get the kid through college, I've got to sell the house, we'd have to retire, la, 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 before I could even think about it, no. Go and talk to these guys because they're so much fun <laughs> that just like they do with auto loans and mortgages, it's like, are, are you doing sign language? Did you break it down <laughs> for me or did you just have so much fun with this I went this for auto and you went to And then you couldn't stop. It didn't work. I know. But, okay. So anyway, just like they do with all of their other stuff, with small business loans, they do the same thing. Same level of customer service. They will walk you through the process even if this process for your situation is five years. They will help you get the money and help make your dreams come true. They're, they're like the very godmothers of, of small business loans. They are seriously into local and mm -hmm. helping people get off the ground. It's awesome. So yeah. check this out and we'll have a fun surprise when we get back from the package. Ooh. Okay, we found Mr. Steve Matthews. Steve, thanks for talking to us today. You're welcome. Okay, Todd and I have been super busy. Mm -hmm. We have talked auto loans. We have talked mortgages and visa rewards, and today it is all about small business loans. All you, tell us about why we should come here, about your team, all that good stuff. Sure. Well, University Federal Credit Union is member-driven, and so we, we serve our members in full capacity with a wide range of uh, business products, uh, from commercial loans to uh, SBA loans to lines of credit to equipment loans, any, any type of loan that you would need to help your business grow and function, we can provide for you. You know, there, so. are, there are four of these guys on the team, Holly, and they've uh -huh. all got tremendous experience. They've been around for not a long time, but you're not well, older we, fellas. Between, but between <laughs> the four of us, we probably, probably have uh, you know, a good 40, yeah. 40 or 50 or right. plus years of experience in commercial lending. And uh, each of us bring a little something to the table and uh, we, we each have uh, our own little little niches that we've uh, focused on over the years, and uh, but it makes us a strong team. And, and they're so. pretty good golfers, too. And we're pretty really? Good golfers, yeah. Wow. <laughs> have, you, have you played a few rounds? Uh, no, not with these guys. They're too good for no, me. Oh, yeah. He's very competitive with right. the golf. Yeah. It's, it's pretty intense. It's a problem. Is it, um, is it hard to get a loan as far as credit? Do you have to have perfect credit? I mean, how, how does one go about it? What's well, the you best know, the, way? Well, that's, that's the, the nice thing. You come in and sit down. We, we address, uh, we, we, we take care of that. We look at those items and, and work through those items with you. Uh, there are some credit standards that we have to meet, mm -hmm. uh, but we, we take those uh, you know, into account and uh, sometimes there, there aren't things that we can do, but, but we'll sit down, we'll work through it. If there's issues, we address those and see what we can do to move forward as far as you know, making the loan and getting, getting you approved. Uh, because the idea is that we've got the products, we want to put those to use, especially for our members and, and those who are here in our community that, that we're focused on. On providing these services for so. So would you say the best way would be just to come in and talk to you? You've got a business idea, you are, or you've got a small business you've been able to get going up to a certain point, but you've got a way you want yep. to expand. Yep. Bring in the idea, bring in your stuff to you, and then let you guys just take it from there. Yep. I mean, we've got we've got business owners that are startups that we've met at the farmers market, uh -huh. and now they're um, they've moved on from the farmers market. They've they're opening retail locations. 
and wow. growing their business that way. We've got this, we've got people that have started in their garages that are looking to buy commercial real estate now to expand. And the discussion, you can, you, you know, you're welcome to go to the website and look at little particulars there, but but really to have that discussion, we you, you do better coming in face to face and and having that one-on-one uh, -on -one experience with uh, myself or one of our loan officers here in the branch. Because it's so customizable based on how many different it, options it is. you, it's, you it's have. It's more than just an auto loan yeah. that we're focusing on. Yeah. It's, it's a business and the business has a lot of aspects to it. Um, you know, we're looking at wh how, what the business does. We're also looking at how you as a manager operate and, and make your business work. So, yeah. And again, you know, whether you're buying an apartment building or you're buying a building for your business or you just need a line of credit to, to take your business up to the next level, uh -huh. we have the tools and the resources that can help us do that. So don't ever be scared. If there's a part you don't know, don't feel intimidated. <laughs> right. Get in it, here, talk to Steve. It's really just a function of giving us a call and, uh, and, and talking through the process. Yeah. Thanks so much for all you You're do welcome. to help build our community and our economy and taking the time to talk to us. You're welcome. Well, that was cool. Lots of good information from mm -hmm. Steve and the guys, but mm -hmm. you promised me a surprise. I know. Are you going to cough? <coughs> <laughs> Are you ready you, for the surprise? You promised me a throat lozenge. I, I don't have a lozenge, but so... From this whole little small business loan adventure that Todd and I went on, mm -hmm. uh, this week we are going to be talking to the Cowboy Cauldron, or next week we'll be talking to the Cowboy Cauldron and the Bagel Project. They both got their starts because University Credit Union funded them, believed in them, helped them. And their stories are so cool. I can't wait for you to see it. And because that ended up being such a cool segment, we are going to be doing it all year. We'll have a segment called Small Talk where I get to go out and talk with small businesses, businesses that otherwise would not be able to advertise, and not just businesses that got their loan through University Credit Union, but any small business that needs some attention and we want to highlight them, it's gonna happen all this year. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Okay, well, I wanna see it. I'm gonna feel like Ed McMahon in a way. Like I get to just show up with a camera crew and be like, tell me all about you. I wanna see your oversized checks. I won't be exactly like it, man, because it's really not that Your cool. plaid coat. But it's kind of cool, right? You no, know, it's cool. I know. It's totally cool. I'm really excited. Okay, don't go anywhere. We'll be right back right after this. University Credit Union. Local to Utah. Loyal to you. Still struggling with where to earn that degree? I just don't want to waste time learning stuff I already know. Check out WGU. They let you fly through what you know so you can focus on what you don't. That's wise. Was that an owl joke? WGU, it's a new kind of you. Welcome back to Talk 365, by the way. That was a really cool surprise. I told you you would like it. Yeah, I like, the, I like small talks. It's going to be so much fun. Can I do some? Absolutely. Okay, good. That would be Ed McMahon. I got a coat. You have the jacket for it. Okay. Get some big checks. Yeah. Um, in all like reality, I would have loved to have had something like that, an outlet to be able to go. So that's really cool of University Credit oh, yeah. to sponsor us, to be able to go and focus. Yes. Very helpful. Yeah. Very fun. Now, talk about our next show, please. Yes, we have Kent Dunn in. He's a local film critic like myself, and we're going to give you a spring preview. That is a little preview of everything coming your way this spring to your local cinema house. So you're going to want to tune in tomorrow. And in the meantime, have a fantastic day. I am Holly Love. I'm Rich Bonaducci. Thank you for watching. Better? Yeah, better. More concise? Okay. Okay.